This is a binary counter. It counts from zero to 1023 in binary and can be used to create audio distortions, live lighting for models, and a million other things. This is one of the easiest and most versatile circuits you can make. For the first part, we only need five components. A breadboard, a 4060 counter chip, a 20,000 ohm resistor, a million ohm resistor, and a 1UF capacitor. Place the counter into the breadboard, make sure the notch side of the chip is facing the top of the board. Then take our capacitor and connect it from pin 9 to an unconnected segment of the breadboard below the chip. Now let's connect our 20,000 ohm resistor from pin 10 to the capacitor segment. Lastly, use our 1 million ohm resistor to connect pin 11 to the same breadboard segment connecting our capacitor and our 20,000 ohm resistor. Congratulations, this is a fully functioning binary counter circuit. Now we just need to add power connections and LEDs. For this part, we need 10 LEDs, 10 1000 ohm resistors, and a handful of jumper wires. First, the power connections. Connect pin 16 of the IC to our power plane, and then connect pin 8 to the ground plane. Now let's add our LEDs. Space them out evenly and make sure all the LEDs are placed with a positive lead facing the same way. Next, take all of your resistors and connect the negative leads of the LED to our ground plane. Lastly, use the schematics to connect the binary output pins to our LEDs in sequence from right to left. And now you have a working... Wait, it's not working. Oops, I forgot to connect the reset pin to ground. Always make sure you read the schematics carefully. And there you have it, a fully functional counter circuit. Schematics and documentation for this project will be available on my GitHub under binary counter circuit.